Now we're going to examine the hyoid. The hyoid is an extremely important junction and later on when we perform the techniques uh, this, uh, imp the importance of the hyoid will become uh, the, um, understood. The first thing to do is to find it. So we try to expose it because when we go from above down we have some um, structures that will make it difficult to find. So one way to find the hyoid is to go maybe from below up. Anyway, these are the things that we have to consider. Once we identify the hyoid, we would like to check its mobility from side to side and its position in relation to the flow of the jaw. Now, in this case, her hyoid feels in a good position slightly below and of course uh, its position is an indication to the level of tension that sometimes people feel in this area. Of course it's all relative because different jaws have different shapes. Now in this case once the fingers identify the hyoid we move it laterally side to side. We would like to check whether it's very very um, pulled backwards or forward because as we remember the hyoid is a floating it's a floating uh, bone and in this case you can see very nice movement we check movement from one side to another we're looking for crepitus clicking and this is a static examination of the hyoid